Hi, this is Felix with Castmasters. Today we'll be unboxing our new addition to the Castmasters furnaces is the propane furnace. Warning, always use your furnace in a well ventilated area and also have a fire extinguisher close by. Here's what you'll find when you open the Castmasters propane furnace box. You'll find the steel propane furnace. You'll also have the rubber hose, your regulator. You'll also have the adjustable valve. You'll have the connector which connects onto your propane furnace. You will have the fire brick which sits at the bottom of the inside of the propane furnace which helps stabilize the crucible. You'll have the tongs which allow you to pull the crucible from out of the propane furnace when it reaches your desired temperature. Before you start using your Castmasters propane furnace, there are a couple of safety items that you can purchase. One is the full face safety shield and two is your high heat resistant safety glove. First, we're going to screw this end of the rubber hose to the regulator. Connect like so until it's flush completely rubber onto metal and then we're going to tighten back this yellow tab to secure your regulator to your rubber hose from any gas leaking. Before you attach your rubber hose to your valves, it's very important to pick up some plumber's pipe tape. Next, we're going to tape with the plumber's tape this end of the furnace adapter so that you have a secure and tight fit to the valve. Next, we're going to attach the adapter into the propane furnace. Unscrew the screws like so. Make sure it's flush then tighten firmly and you can tighten even more so with your wrench. Now we're going to attach the regulator to your propane tank. Before turning on your propane tank, make sure that every single connection at every point is tightened securely. An extra safety measure is to spray soapy water at every connection area to see if there's any other visible leaks. Now that you've secured all your valve connections and tested with soapy water to make sure there is no gas in fact leaking, you're now ready to ignite your propane furnace. First step is to make sure your valve on this end is in the off position, which is perpendicular to your hose. This is closed. This is open, make sure it's off. You turn it on by turning it counterclockwise. Your regulator reading should be between one and two. If it's not enough, you go clockwise to increase the level. Now, if you need to decrease, you need to reset your valve by turning off your tank, releasing the pressure, and then following that step over again. We're now ready to light the furnace, make sure now you open the valve to let the gas in. You can increase or decrease heat by opening this valve here. If you open it up, it allows more air in, creating a higher level of heat. Now we're gonna use your tongs and place the crucible inside. And just close the lid. Also, another thing to keep in mind, the propane furnace does heat up at a high speed. Therefore, with that high speed of heat, you will experience a little bit of warping on the top of the furnace. Also, the paint is going to burn off a little bit for the first few times you start your furnace. That is normal. A couple things to keep in mind. Uh, it's very important to have a high rated thermometer so that you know what the heat is inside your crucible. If you have any further questions or concerns, please contact us directly at castmastershelp at gmail.com.